in our previous uh, part you can see in javascript get value from checkbox in javascript i have showed okay now in this part i am going to show you how to get value from option in javascript okay i mean of get option value in javascript or all tutorials uploaded in this playlist you can see html form in php javascript this playlist okay just go our channel youtube.com slash wcoderjohn and then go to playlist tab you will get all videos however so let's go to say live in here you can see our previous php tutorial i have showed get option using php get option value using javascript now okay javascript and just remove the php block and suppose all are okay and in here our form action and method you can remove or keep okay but in javascript you don't record action and method you can keep it or remove it it will not affect on your javascript code however in here from work with javascript you need to write here a event i hope if you check our previous tutorial you already know about that suppose on submit our event when sub visitor click on submit button then this event will trigger i mean work okay and you can here write a function anything as you wish okay suppose i write according our previous form controller function i will create it and here will be return false okay now in here suppose you can also create an external file for javascript i am showing you as a tutorial purpose here okay but in advanced level i will show you all so don't worry a script a script in here just create this function just write first function just write function key and then our function name okay and curly brackets and in here suppose so which value we want to get we want to get our option value okay for getting this option value here just write a variable suppose variable i write um, indexed okay indexed remember that suppose in here our option below okay when you select some index below it will i mean when using javascript it will react as a indexed okay when you insert i mean choose a option javascript or php or javascript or c plus plus etc when you choose uh, options it will works as an index in javascript okay and for that you need to catch the index suppose which index or option your visitor have choosed okay i mean suppose your visitor have uh, choose java or javascript or c plus plus anything can choose okay but when choose it will every option react as a indexed in javascript okay and for that we can write we need to catch our indexed when you get to value from option okay especially in javascript i have write a variable indexed you can write anything as you wish here and just here write document dot document dot our form name my form dot our select of tag name we have write languages okay languages dot here will be selected as selected i will be capital letter index selected index okay selected index and then again after after getting the selected index that uh, suppose uh, like that when select this index okay and now need to get this index value okay suppose your visitor choose java and now you have select your java index but now you need to catch your java index value this value okay java php or javascript something like that and for that you need to write suppose again a variable suppose i write indexed value equal to as like same document dot my form dot languages okay sorry just copy document dot my form my form and then our languages and then dot our options here will be need to write your options and third bracket each 
option array i mean indexed array values will be as a array okay and for that options and here just write your indexed this indexed okay which indexed your visitor choose so languages option indexed dot value okay options indexed value i hope you understand you can see first i have catch the selected index okay which option your visitor or you choose okay this index i have just first catch here you can see just selected index then i have catch the selected index value document dot my form languages here will be options cause each are our options okay and then square bracket or third bracket that you call for getting the indexed okay is like working as an array and for that you need to write the square bracket okay and here will be your indexed variable where you have store your indexed okay and then your value i want to get the indexed value selected indexed value okay so it's okay and now suppose i can declare another variable suppose show data i write you can write anything as you wish. show data equal to suppose i can format it some text suppose you are a just concat your variable okay here our all value this variable suppose php java or javascript all value in this variable and uh, you can again concat suppose you are a suppose java php or etc i can write programmer okay now it's complete and now i want to show this result suppose top of my form you can show in anywhere top or bottom or another piece however suppose i write here div or something like that div and i write an id here suppose id equal to result and in here i can write document dot get element by id okay document dot get element by id which id this id result here will be show dot inn here in our html equal to our this formatted result okay will be show document dot get element by id result dot in our html equal to our formatted result so i hope you understand if you listened or watching my tutorial attentively however now refresh your browser just refresh and select suppose php submit you can see you are a php programmer okay or if you suppose java submit you can see you are a java programmer or if you write javascript you can see you are a javascript programmer also you can bolt this language values just in here just write b bold html bold tag okay b this language i mean selected value this value will be bold and taking refresh just java you can see java is bold you are a java programmer i have write in formatted data you are a then bold our language then programmer okay so i hope you understand okay how to get value from option so practice it and stay connected with w coder zone for getting more tutorials also i hope you can subscribe for getting the notifications when i upload a new video in my channel you will get a notifications when you subscribe my channel subscribe and uh, when you subscribe you will get a bell button beside the subscribe button and just check mark the bell button okay and you will get all notifications when i upload a new video so thank you practice it